stunning. What's up, babes? We are back with another video. Welcome or welcome back in today's video in my channel, which is your channel. We're going to be playing with the Chantacayo Spring 2021 collection. I have right here this pretty, pretty little thing, things. And if you're ready to see what's up with these products and how did I create this stunning eye look with no effort, super quick and super simple, keep on watching. Mwah. We already know that Chantacayo always have a purpose with each collection and every product they come out with. They love supporting the animals, they love supporting something. So the whole deal with this collection is that Chantacao it is supporting the Sagrosarides societies. Okay, which works to conserve in Tevarest and their habitants by regenerating native landscaping. In turn, promotion a vibrant food system. Chantacao's donation will support the restoration of more than 40 acres of native habitants for butterflies and others pollinators in California's Central Valley, source of a quarter of our nation food. That is so special. I love it. I picked up the Butterfly Eye Quartet and it is $72. Inside of this quartet, we have shade one. It's a top with a satin finish. Shade two, a triple chrome with pink, green, and gold pairs. Shade three, a shimmery peach. And shade four, a rose gold with a satin finish. I also picked up one of the lip sheets. They come in three different shades. This one is pink. It's a flirty neutral pink. We have a peachy one and a note one. Each one, it is $48. Let's go and let me show you how I created this look. Mwah. Okay, so we're gonna be creating this pretty soft, delicate eye look that I am so in love with. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with that shimmery green, guys. It's like a chrome. You see the reflection. Oh, I love it. With this baby right here. So we're gonna be grabbing our blending brush and we're gonna start with the first shade right here. Starting from my outer V. I'm gonna pack a punch on my brush and I'm gonna leave some sitting there and the rest, whatever. So my brush, I'm gonna be bringing it into my crease. Just like that. Now with the same brush, I'm gonna be grabbing a punch and what I'm gonna do is, without blending it, I'm gonna leave some on my outer V and I'm gonna be packing the shade through my whole crease because I wanna get the most color payoff out of this shade and that's the best way when you just place the shade without blending it. Perfect. Now I'm gonna be grabbing my BK Beauty 201 and I'm gonna blend these edges right here by my brow bone, very soft. With my Ref 201, first I'm gonna show you how the shades look dry and then we are gonna wet them. I'm gonna be placing this peachy shade right here on my inner corner. That is how it looks dry. We are gonna be wetting it on a second on my inner corner and on my tear dog. I just wet my brush, my Ref 201, and I'm gonna go back into this peachy shade. And I'm gonna place it on my tear dog and on my inner corner. Now we are gonna go into this shade right here, which is like the star of the show, they're green. It is stunning. I am gonna be swatching it, so don't worry. But I am gonna go straight up and wet my brush because I just don't wanna make no mess. And at first I went in with my brush dry and there was a little bit of fallout, but it is all worth it for that shade right there. So wet your brush and saved the mess. Plus, if you wear your brush, you get the most pigmentation out of it. And I'm gonna place this right here on the center of my lid, and I'm gonna bring it really high. The higher up you bring the shimmer, the bigger your eye is gonna look. A little bit on top of this peachy shade. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm in love with this shade, I swear. This is like the perfect shade for spring. Look at the combination of my eyes with this, like, picture. <laughs> now with my blending brush, I'm gonna be grabbing this shade right here, that is the darker shade out of the whole four. And I'm gonna pack a punch and I'm gonna place it right here on my 
outer V. Without blending it too much, the shades are beautiful, guys. You don't even need to do no blending. That's crazy. I'm so happy with this look. You have no clue. I'm going to be using my eyeliner from Marc Jacob on the shade Wera. It's this stunning green right here. It's not the same green, but this is going to look stunning. I'm going to be placing a little bit of this on my waterline. I'm gonna be using my flat defender from Sonia G. I did with my brush and I'm gonna go into the beautiful green. I'm gonna be placing this on the inner part of my lower lash and I'm grabbing it and I'm grabbing a punch with my brush and I'm patting it in. I'm not doing no type of blending with this shade, guys. gonna go in with this beautiful lipstick on the shade Clover. We're gonna be putting it on and for lip liner I'm using the Charlotte Tavery Pillow Talk lip liner. Look at this guys. This is so chic. No wonder they're called the lip chic. Look at that. Can this be any more cuter? Like the whole green vibe is giving me life. First, let me swatch it for you really quick right here on the back of my head. See, it is really balmy. It's like a wash of color, but this pink is super pretty. And mm. I love the formulation of these lip cheeks. Ah, they're so hydrating. Mm, look at that. And it does have a lot of pigmentation. I thought it was gonna be more sheer. So pretty. I swear, Chantacao makes me happy. Look at that. In case you were wondering if these two babies are the same, no, they're not. This is way pinky than the other one, and I am gonna be swatching it for you because I know how it is. So we'll be looking at stuff and we're like, I have the other one, it's almost the same, and then we skip on it and it's really not the same. This one right here is way more pinky. This is super soft. Super, super soft, guys. Look at that. It's like it's like my lips, but better. I adore these products. All right, so you already saw how I created this eye look and how many times did I tell you throughout the video that I'm just obsessed. I'm so obsessed with the reflection of this green, the whole eye look, the lips, everything, everything. I'm really, 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 really with it. Like this green, it is doing something to me. There's really not much to say right here on my final thoughts. Like my final thoughts is that I love it, I love it, I love it, and I freaking love it. Can you picture this? will look stunning on lighter skin complexions, on my skin complexions, and on deep skin complexions. This is going to be booming on everybody's face. It looks so soft on the pen that you will think that the colors are gonna be so sheer, that they're not gonna show, but as soon as you pop this green on your lids, you are like, boom, 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 boom. Wow, I'm so happy I got this palette. For real. It's beautiful, guys. Like, I'm amazed. And then with the little compact, like, I'll be like all day, like, hey, looking at myself in the mirror. Only so you guys can see this little thing. Like, the design of it. <laughs> I'm dying. Like, this is so freaking cute, guys. Please. Like, I can't deal. I really, really, really can't deal. All right, guys. So, this is the swatches. Remember, they are buildable. So, the more you put on, the more you put on, the more booming it's going to be. But you see them perfect. This is the lip cheek on the shade. What shade this is? Clover. And, and then this one, it is this pinky from the other collection that a bunch of us have. I totally recommend you to pick up this collection. You know what's funny? That the one from last year, the the eyeshadows they didn't really drag me in i don't have them i never picked them up but this one did the whole packaging and then even the shades i know they were gonna look pretty plus i love me some green so as soon as i saw that green i was like i need it on my life and what are i babes thank you again for another great video i love you all so damn much and if you're not subscribed to my channel yeah what are we doing here i hope now you are considering subscribing go down below 
click the little red button and make sure you put your notification bell on so YouTube can notify you every time me right here upload new videos. Mwah! I love you.